Yo, YouTube, what's going on? Welcome back to another randomizer video. Uh, again, this is like my 32nd time doing an intro for this, I think, or maybe 33rd. I can't even remember. Uh, so here we are again. We're on this, this, this website. This website is linked down below. It's a randomizer website where basically I hit this re-randomize button and it spits out a bunch of random stuff. Killers, add-ons, perks, everything. Offering everything. Um, the only thing I, I gotta say, this time we're doing something a little bit differently. It's not that different, but I turned off the options to get either the any perk slots or the none perk slots because that feels like it's not really true to being random, right? And like same thing with killer and, and everything, right? There's no any or nuns, right? It's just, it's always going to give me something because I feel like it's not very true to the randomizer to like be able to pick things myself or just get told like right here to run nothing, right? Like this is kind of silly. I, I don't, I don't really like this, you know, I feel like there should always be something that's kind of like the fun of the randomizer. So we're going to do that. And I think I'm going to do that going forward. If you guys are cool with it, if you guys have any objectives or uh, uh, objectives, if you have any objections, let me know. But otherwise I'm just going to do it like this going forward. Cause I think this is probably the better way to do it. Anyway, let's see what we get. Bada bam. Okay. 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 Yo, Plague plus Blood Favor is actually one, like one of my favorite combos in this whole game. It's so funny. Sometimes people will, ran will like randomly get injured like across the map, and then a bunch of a bunch of pallets will just randomly get blocked. It's so funny. Um, we have Haunted Ground to go with it too, which is actually not terrible. Although Haunted Ground on Plague maybe is less good because you get people injured borderline for free anyway. Grim Embrace is a bit odd. Knockout's a bit odd. This is honestly not terrible for a randomizer. This is not terrible. Putrid Oak, I ain't gonna complain. Um, which one is this? Increases the effectiveness of Vile Purge by 40%. That's pretty nice. Oh, and Black Incense. Oh, that's a good set of add-ons, too. This is actually a pretty solid build for uh, a randomizer. Oh, man. Okay, let's go put it together. Okay, here's the build. I really don't hate this. Um, incoming... <laughs> oh, man. Although, something I do hate is, is playing Plague on, on videos. Because I feel like I always spend my entire video shitting on this killer. And then, my, then the comment section is just a bunch of people shitting on me, shitting on the killer. <laughs> <laughs> Can I just, you know, I just want to, I want to like preface and say that my opinion on Plague is very biased and I'm aware of that, okay? I talk very badly about Plague because I find her very frustrating to play and I call her dog shit and stuff all the time and truth be told, I know that I'm most likely incorrect, but I'm still going to shout about it anyway. I'm still going to keep confidently saying that she's dog shit even if I know that I'm most likely incorrect, okay? I just want to throw that out there. But you guys can keep shitting on me if you guys want. That's cool too. But this build's really solid and I'm excited to play it, so let's do it. Okay, um, these guys burnt an Orban offering. I don't know what that means. Does that mean something? Are they gonna do like boiler for things or something? Is this like the new RPD? I, Cause I've seen people do it upstairs. I've seen it. I've seen it happen. Anyway, uh, sorry, I should stop being distracted. Uh, I really hope blood favor stays up. Like, I feel like we're pretty much guaranteed to lose a totem early, right? Mm, are they doing that one? Are they working right beside it and not doing it? That's kind of interesting. Blah, 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 blah. Did that get that? Oh, it didn't. Land your puke, you fool. You foolish fool. Did he stay? Ah, oh, shit, I was too busy looking around. I didn't see if he stayed or went. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay, there's scratch marks here. I think this is him. Um, But anyway, I really hope Blood Favor stays up. Because Blood Favor is a really fun perk on Plague. But the fact that I just have that and uh, and uh, Haunted Ground makes me not very confident. Also, these totem spots are terrible. These totem spots are in horrible, horrible places. Um... So, yeah, I feel like they're probably not going to stay up. If we're just going to be real, most likely not staying up. Okay. Okay, someone just started. I don't know. That could have been a totem or a gen. I'm not sure what that was. But somebody's doing something. <laughs> the Michaela. Okay, someone else is doing something. These guys are definitely doing things. Okay, th th this stuff's increased. So, like, if I can get him injured before he throws. Yeah, if I can get him injured before he throws the pallet. I want to get him before he throws the pallet. That way I can get blood favor value. Wait, she got injured across the map. Okay, wait, but it blocks pallets near her. Okay, I'm almost positive she booned up one of those hexes, right? Wait, was it blood favor that she booned? I don't know. I can't actually tell. Good dead hard. I don't... Uh, is blood favor gone? Shit, I think it is. Is it that... Shit, I think it is. No, dude! Did they actually snipe out blood favor whenever I have Haunted Ground too? Hey, we got everyone injured though. That's kind of nice. The fact that we got everyone injured, I feel like I should maybe slug this guy for knockout value, but I'm gonna hook him instead. It's kind of weird because I have knockout, but I also have Grim Embrace. So like on one hand, I want to hook people, but then on another hand, I don't want to hook people. Wait, that was the obsession. Shit. Wait, no, that's actually good. I do want to hook the obsession. 
Sorry, my, my, my brain's working like faster than I can think right now. The the obsession is good. It's good for me to, to hook him first. I don't want to hook him last. That's what I don't want to do. Hooking him last would be a bad idea. I am going to slug here, though. We have wall hacks on this guy, thanks to Black Incense. Um, This is a really good game for them to not cleanse. If these guys try to go like the no cleansing route, this is actually going to be really good for me. This pilot kind of sucks. Oh, these guys might get 4K'd right now. These guys could get 4K'd literally right now. I mean, she's probably going to have dead hard. So maybe she'll make it to this pilot, actually. Oh, no, I got stuck. She didn't even have the dead hard. Oh, that was horrible. My, like, little, my little, my little, my little diseased leg got stuck on the wall. I didn't even have, she didn't even have to. That sucks. What a bummer. This is a weird loop. Okay, she's going upstairs. I'm just going to come back around to near where the David was. Honestly, I'm just going to hook him, I guess. Fuck it. Like, he's fully recovered now. She's almost in struggle state over there. Just balanced. I think she's going to go. Oh, yeah, he already went to struggle. So, honestly, that's fine. He went to struggle. I still get this hook. Everyone's still injured. This is A-OK -okay with me, dude. This is A-OK -okay with me. And I'm assuming her, their teammate is still just sitting on a gen somewhere, maybe? Like, I'm honestly not even sure. Nia. Oh, Nia. Mm, that was a good play. Yer! Hey, Haunted Ground's active now. Not that it matters. Everyone's injured anyway. See, that's what I thought about Haunted Ground. I had a feeling the Haunted Ground wouldn't actually get any value because, you know, what the fuck's Exposed do whenever everyone's injured all the time anyway? You know what I mean? I guess I gotta go get this, dude. Ay, I kind of don't really have any good plays here. These guys are all pretty good. They're all pretty good in chase. They're not really making any mistakes. I'm really sure what to do. I don't really want to camp this out either, but now I feel like I'm in this weird position where I almost have to. Like, I'm not sure what else to do here. I need to bait the Nia into getting the save. That way I can down her. Which I think I just did. Yeah. See, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to get the Nia down. That way I can get three out of four. Like, these guys are booning, but what the fuck are the boons doing for him, dude? I'm fucking plague. Why did I think I heard him and then also saw him? Am I okay today? Like, am I okay? What is happening to me? For some reason, I thought I heard the survivor, but there was, like, no one there? I don't know what the fuck is... Okay, someone's cleansing. Also, someone's puking. This is the last survivor I need, right? Yeah, this is the last one I need for some good old grim and braze value, baby. They did cleanse, though. That's... Wait, this is Michaela. This is Michaela right here. I gotta, I gotta break out this wall. I hate this map. I should have brought out this wall. That's a lot better. Wait, you're the Michaela. Wait, what? Is there two? Wait, is there two Michaelas? No. Yes. No. No. Wait, was that not the Michaela I was chasing? Bro, I'm telling you, I'm not okay today. I'm not okay. I'm going to blame the lack of sleep I got last night, but holy shit, I'm struggling right now. Okay. This will activate Grim Embrace. And then after this, maybe I can start slugging? Like, I really feel like I should have been... Maybe I should have been slugging sooner. Like, maybe knockout value would have been better here than Grim Embrace value. Like, that David that I slugged, he stayed on the ground for quite a bit. I'm going to see where the Leon is here, which is actually pretty solid. I said I'm going to see where the Leon is. There he is. This is actually pretty solid because he's the only one that isn't sick. So I can go get him sick. And then we got everybody sick, you know? You know what I mean? Isn't that sick? How sick is that? That's sick, isn't it? Hello. Mm, I kind of want to grab this puke, but also he's leaving. Man, I really wish we could have kept Blood Favor up, dude. That's such a fun perk. We like we like barely even got a chance to play around with it. Okay, we're gonna leave him on the ground. And mm, maybe I should have grabbed it. I'm gonna grab this puke. The problem with this is like if I wait, does not knock out. Yeah, knockout still works with basic attacks. The problem is, is if I down him with my puke, I don't actually get the knockout on him. But that's okay, right? Because if I down him with the puke, I still get value out of him being down, you know? So it's kind of okay. I don't even want to... You know what? I guess I'll snuff it. I don't even think snuffing these boons is even that important, though. It doesn't seem like it's Shadow Step. At least, not that one, anyway. Okay. I think... I think Michaela's actually picking him up right now. This is a good juke. Let's see what she decides to do. Okay, see like I can't like slugging her here makes no sense. So I'm gonna I'm gonna hook her. Actually, maybe they were just working on agenda. What the fuck? I didn't even hear that. Oh my god. This is like the this is dude, this is this match is actually embarrassingly bad. Bro. Plague by the way. Plague by the way. Plague by the way. 
plague, by the way. God, fuck this killer, dude. How did I, how did I, I literally did not even hear that flashlight click. I didn't, I also didn't even hear myself getting blinded. You know, you, you, you know what a problem that I'm coming to realize is about my gameplay? I'm coming to realize that a problem with my gameplay is because I never shut the fuck up, I literally talk over my own sound. Like I talk over my own gameplay sound. That gen's almost done too, so these, so the gens are pretty much done. But I literally talk over like my own game sound, and I think that's what happened right there. I couldn't even hear her like prepping that flashlight because I was too busy talking, and I was hearing myself talking. You know? How bad is that? He dead hearted, which is okay. Oh, oh, how the turntables! Oh, yes. I'm, they actually weren't doing this gen. That's surprising. This gen had a lot of progress on it. I'm going to hook this dude. We're actually in a really good spot now. Because these guys are basically continuously sick. And we ha and we actually have some pools of corruption. Like, they can keep healing each other or whatever. Okay, maybe it wasn't as far as I thought it was. They can keep doing that all they want. Because we have a lot of pools of corruption here. And they're, and they're, and they're just going to keep getting sick every time they, like, unhook each other and shit. So it's kind of not even a problem. These guys are not affected by knockout because I downed them with my puke and not my M1, so I kind of need to hook them. I'm not going to get any knockout value. Although, I feel like knockout was giving me value this game, which is kind of nice. See, like, even there, like, she's sick now, so that's okay, right? Like, them cleansing? Fine with me, dude. Fine with me. Did the other guy stay? Looks like he went this way. There's scratch marks down here. Why, hello? Why, hello there? Why, hello? All right. She should be death too, right? She should be dead, I think. I believe. I believe. God damn, these motherfuckers are cleansing like crazy now. Now all of a sudden they're addicted to cleansing. These motherfuckers didn't cleanse at all at first. I don't, I don't know how we're getting this like this okay of a result. We play, I played this match so bad, dude. I played this match so bad. To be fair though, I feel like this is, this is usually what happens. I'll play badly and then I'll be like, this killer sucks. <laughs> and then the YouTube comment section gives me a bunch of shit, which is pretty fair. It's pretty justified shit. I still don't think Plague is a very high, a very high tier killer, but I know I'm, I know I'm also not the best with her. But I still, man, I'm just going to say it, you know, while I have this downtime where I'm not actually chasing anybody, I'm just going to say it. I I have never seen a plague player that played in a way that's ever, like, impressed me and convinced me that she's a good killer. It's never happened. Someone's here. I'm just going to grab the corrupt pubic and then get her. Hello. So until that happens, man, I'm going to I'm stick firm. See, like, right there, if I was a better plague, I probably would have known that wouldn't, that wouldn't have landed, right? What the fuck was that? Are you from Mars? Are you a literal Martian? Blah, 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 blah. But I feel like this is honestly a pretty good plague map, right? Like all these rock tiles are kind of like perfect for plague because you can puke right over them. I feel like that's a big thing too, right? I feel like plague is also very map dependent. This feels like a kind of okay map for her, you know? There's lots of like smaller tiles that you can like, you know, get your puke over. There's a lot less of the bigger ones. Like tiles like this one right here, like this, like this maze tile, this jungle gym. I feel like they're insane against this killer. Like just nutty good. Is he gonna go for the is he gonna go for the unhook? I saw nothing going towards the Hmm. Interesting. I didn't see anything going towards that door. But maybe he's at that door. I don't know. How far away can I see the red lights? Oh, I think I just saw him. I just saw, yeah, I just saw him. Shit! No! No! I thought he was gonna go for the unhook, but he's greedy. Not like this. Not like this. That's okay. Dude, with how horrible we played this game, man, we like we were like walking into flashlight saves. We were like fucking missing shit. We were getting people confused. Holy, with how, with how, with how bad we played this match, this is a fantastic result. I gotta say, that is a fantastic result. Holy. Thank the Lord. Because that this game could have easily been like a zero K. I'm going to say like black incense coming through. Knockout kind of came through. Uh, yeesh. All, all I'm going to say is yeesh. GG's. Uh, let's go back to the randomizer. We'll see what we get for the second build. Hopefully we get a killer that I am a little bit better with. Okay, boys. Let's see what we get for round two. Hopefully we get something good like this. This was cool. These videos are always very hit or miss as far as the builds go, right? Like sometimes we get like pretty solid builds like this. And sometimes we get total dog shit. So... Let's hope for another good one. Bam!
Uh, hey, like I said, like I said, you know, sometimes you get good things and sometimes you get four of the worst perks in the entire fucking game, you know? Hey, that's just how it, <laughs> that's just how it be sometimes. We got Freddy, Shadowborn, Gearhead, Hangman, Strike, Lullaby. These are all terrible. Like, Shadowborn, I guess, is just like a feel-good perk. It doesn't, I wouldn't really say this is like a strong perk. It's more like a feel-good perk. Lullaby is pretty awful. Gearhead's pretty awful. Hangman's... These are all terrible. These are these are just all terrible. Um, Yellow Mist. And hey, we got Black Box, though, which I don't even know if... Like, like now, I don't even know if that's good anymore. Swing Change is the... Fount the well, survivors in the dream world, the sounds of their footsteps are louder. Man, let's just go throw it together. All right, I mean, uh, we got an ultra rat on, but, but I don't even really know, like, I mean, maybe this will come in handy. This is such a strange add-on. They changed this a while back and made it so that recently opened gates are blocked for 15 seconds, which is just a really weird thing to do. This seems like it might be good, like, against 99 in gens, I guess, or not, not 99 in gens, against 99 in gates, which might be kind of useful. I mean, we'll see if it comes into play. Swing change is interesting. People just have louder footsteps, but the perks I'm running are just awful. Like Gearhead and Hangman's are like two of the worst tracking perks in the game. And Lullaby is like, I think Lullaby actually can be okay if you can keep it up for a long ass time. But that's the thing. Keeping up Hex Totems for a long ass time is like next to impossible in the current day and age. Because first off, everybody knows where totems spawn. And second off, people run boons often, which means they're actively seeking out totems all the time. So I, the chance of this staying up without even like having Undying or any other support hexes is basically slim to none. So yeah, I mean, let's go find some people on gens using gearheads. Smile, let's go do it. Let's go do it, man. Oh man, a big map too. Nice. Okay. Well, we'll see what we can do. Maybe we can make something work. I don't know. Um. All right. We spawned on this side, about halfway down. Someone might have spawned here. Maybe. Ooh, I don't think I've ever played Freddy with Shadowborn before. This is kind of neat. Battleborn killers are so interesting. You see, like, so much more of their weapon. There's somebody here. Hello, is there somebody here? I'm gonna try one thing, and if it works, I'm a god. Hey, I'm not a god. I'm not a god. I'm a nobody. I'm a nobody. You're a loser, Johnny. You're a loser. Nobody cares about you, Johnny. They're gonna get one of those gens done for sure. Like, 100%. It's gonna be that one. That one right there. That gen right there is popping. That one I'm looking at, it's, it's about to pop. Ready? I meant this one. I meant this one. Wait, I still mean that one. I still mean that one, actually. I still mean that one. That's the one that I'm still talking about. He makes this easily. And he didn't throw it for whatever reason. I'm not going to complain. Hmm, it seems like, they seem like they're actually kind of split on all of them up here. Which is interesting. He's not going in. He'll probably... Ooh, what the fuck's he doing? I thought he was going to run around and then dead hard to the pallet. But this is not what I expected. Well, he did dead hard. Ah! I was right about him dead harding. Also, I can't believe they didn't get a gen done. This is crazy. Oh, gearhead. Gearhead, 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 gearhead. Where? What? What gearhead? Tell me. Gearhead, what the fuck are you even telling me? Gearhead just activated as if I saw, as if I'm seeing an aura, but I'm not even seeing an aura. This is why gearhead sucks so much, man. Because you see the auras of people that are sitting on gens, and like, it's so fucking hard to see their auras to begin with, man. Because they're on a gen, and like, the gen aura is red, and their aura is red. And if they're, like, behind it, then, like, best of fucking luck, you know what I mean? Dude, they got, like, slight gen progress on, like, a bunch of different gens. That's so strange. I'm gonna fake that just to scare anybody off that might be on it. We still have the trap here, right? Ugh. I was trying to put it in the... You know what? I kind of unintentionally mind-gamed her. I was just trying to put a trying to put a trap, like, under the pallet, and it just wouldn't go. Hmm. Do I port here to cut her off? Do I play this like I would play Ring Chapter? Yes, I do. Uh, uh, surprise, mother fucker. God damn it. Man, I didn't know what way I was going to be facing. I came out of the teleporter and I got all lost and shit. Unfortunate. She's going to hold WA? No, she's going to go back. Mm, this is a strong set of tiles. I'm going to need to actually kick this. Yeah, I need to actually kick this. These guys seem like they're pretty solid. Okay. I'm going to fake this. I'm not going to actually teleport. I just want to scare them. Oh, maybe I should have teleported. Oh, this is kind of a rough spot, to be honest. Um, She's going to be able to make the window, so I'm just going to kick this out now. Wait, gear had activated again, but I missed it. Oh, no, I missed it. Oh, no, I missed it. Okay, we're going to go over here. There's so many gems of the jungle, dude. So many gems of the jungle. Uh... I feel like what's happening is I'm not even intending to mind gamer. I'm just like literally trying to set up snares and me setting up snares is, is somehow like the best mind games I've ever done in my life. 
Apparently, all I gotta do with every killer, like if you guys are ever playing just like a standard killer and you're struggling to mind game survivors, just just pretend that you're setting up snares. Easy mind games, dude. Easiest mind games of your life. I'm not even gonna bother kicking this. Um, honestly, we kind of have like a four gen set up down there. We might want to protect that. If I really wanted to like try to win this match, I feel like I need to get down to the other side of the map like kind of ASAP, like yesterday. So I'm gonna go for like a, I'm gonna try to hit this dude up until my teleport's up. And then once my teleport's up, I'm just gonna bail. I think, I think that's the plan. Okay, he's actually kind of heading down that way anyway. I'm not really sure exactly what gen to go to though. Maybe I can just run down here. Oh, this has got some progress on it. Oh no. Oh, not like this. Oh, not like this. Yo, Lullaby is actually still up though, by the way. Just, just, just gonna, just gonna throw that out there. Lullaby is still active right now. Oh, what's this? Hello, Fang. We can get a couple more. I'm going to chase him because he was getting healed. So that will waste like their value of the heal. That was a terrible placement for a snare. Mm, fuck. We're, we're in, we're in, we're in a bad spot. We're not, we're not doing great out here. Things are not great. Things are not great for sure. Although them failing that skill check gave him extra regression, thanks to good old Hunter's Lullaby. This guy's gonna dead hard. We love dead hard. We love when people misplay, but it doesn't matter because they can press E. There's no such thing as misplaying when you have the E key, smile. Imagine ever thinking there's such thing as misplaying when there's, when there's the E key. Smile. Smiling face. Okay. Man, we're about to get three stats, but like the game's already freaking over, dude. It doesn't even matter. This is so sad. Up you go. We gotta get over to that gen like ASAP. Go, 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 go. Wow, that actually doesn't even have that much progress, does it? Hello. Okay, we have a gen way down there too, which is a-okay. Okay, they popped it, which is which is cool. Because like I don't really care about that gen too much. That's actually a okay with me. Um what? Her scratch marks look like they just disappeared. Am I insane? I'm just gonna get on here and get these guys. I don't know where that thing went. It looked like her scratch marks just vanished. Maybe I'm just dumb. I mean, I know that I'm dumb, but like, maybe I'm so dumb that I couldn't keep track of where she was. Mm, see, if she just runs the other side of the map now, I kind of have to chase you, Quentin. Sorry, man. Sorry about your luck, duder. <gasps> Feng Min. Feng Min, you dirty hoe diddly. How could you? How could you, you dirty hoe diddly? Oh, this is not ideal. One of them dies here. I thought she might dead hard there, but she didn't. You know, this is actually not the worst position to be in. Is Basement here? If Basement's here, that would be... Oh! This is actually not a bad spot to be in. Like, overall, to be real with you. Like, we're going full, like, tournament mode strats here. But this is actually not too shabby if we, if we hold down this little 3 gen, you know what I mean? I'm actually going to port out to this. We have our, our totems here, too. Which is quite interesting. Hmm... Hmm, hmm, hmm. I mean, I'm holding down this area. I'm doing it. I'm holding down the fort. You know, I'm I'm gonna play slightly sweaty because you know what? I'm playing with a dog shit build, so I feel like I have the right, you know? If there was ever a time for me to play as optimal as possible, this would probably be the time. When I'm using like the most dog shit of dog shit perks. Hello. Honestly, even force you're gonna use that palette is really good. Because that just eliminates more stuff that's on this side of the map. And we want there to be as little stuff on the side of the map as possible. Bruh. Bruh. This is actually nuts. What's happening here? Where is their team? They're going down. They're going down to the basement. If this is the full health guy, I won't be able to down him, but that's okay. Oh. I can get them all injured, and then I could also... I'll just smack her into... Whoa! I was gonna say smack her into deep wounds, but they don't have borrowed time. Interesting. Hey! Hey! Hey, let go of my... Let go of my Zarina! Yo, let go of my Zarina! What the fuck, man? What the fuck, man? That's cool with me, dude. Unless they have a flashlight, do they? Am I about to get flashlights here? Nah, we're good, dude. We're good. I could hook her here. We have five stacks of lullaby, dude. Look at that. We're actually, we actually got stacks of lullaby. I was saying before this game started, I was like, dude, there ain't no way we're, gonna, we're ever going to get a lullaby value, are we? And look at us now. Look at us now, mama. Mama, look at us now. Lullaby value for days. Because it's so, like, it's in such an irrelevant spot of the map. There's, like, no gens there or anything. I guess they've just never gone that far. 
This is a pretty pointless kick, but I feel like I don't know what else to fucking do with myself right now. These guys, like, kind of need to heal up together, but I'm not really sure where they are. And I guess they're not going to heal up together. What? Why? He didn't have borrowed time. And she was just like, take me. Take me, burnt man. Take me. I guess I'm going to go look for this Fang because her DS has got to be close to being up by now. So if, if she even had it at all. What are these guys doing? Like, what's what's the Michaela doing right now? I'm, I'm so confused. I'm not really sure what's going on right now. Like, I feel like these guys should have been able to save each other and been okay. But like, they're just not. They're just not saving each other. Okay, they picked up the Zarina now. So that's good. No hangman strike value ever, as usual. I mean, honestly, maybe I should be looking for hangman strike value more. I haven't really been looking for it as hard as I could have been. Um, I really should be setting snares up in here because these guys are going to be asleep. So I'm just going to set a snare up at every entrance. That way, when they go in, I know about it. Mm. They're all healing. I saw all three of them. There's the, th the third one's down there in the distance, too. So this is actually really good. I know that there's no one anywhere near that unhook right now. This guy's the closest guy, so I can chase him pretty freely. A okay with me, dude. A okay with me. Mm -mm -mm. I hear the Quinton. She went way around, dude. Holy. Quinton, no, not like this. I'm going back. We're going back. We're going back. We're going back, back, back. Oh, this is it. This is curtains. I think this guy had borrowed. No, actually nobody here has borrowed time. I'm gonna hook this dude and then I'm gonna pick her up. And if she even wants to DS me, that's fine because then she'll die right afterwards, right? Like if she has DS, she'll literally just die right afterwards. Actually, no, she won't, she'll get out. Cause I thought she would DS and save that guy. If she DSs me, that's okay. She didn't even DS me. Okay, I kind of feel bad for this Fang. I'm gonna be real. I feel a little bit bad for this Fang. I literally basemented her once, and then she got downed. She got unhooked without borrowed time, and then immediately downed twice. And that was her entire gameplay experience. I'm gonna be real. I feel a little bad. I feel a little. I don't. Was it worth winning this match? Was it worth winning this match? I don't know. I feel bad. It wasn't worth it, dude. I should have just took the L. I should have just let them do the gens and take the L. Who have I become? Who have I become? Who am I anymore? Whoa, the sky looks horrible. The sky looks terrible. Okay, what the hell's going on over here? Hey, man. She's like, follow me. Follow me and I will juice you. I mean, at this point, sure. Why the fuck not, I guess? I mean, who cares? I suppose, right? I'm gonna pick a random gen and fake a teleport. Wait, are you selling out the Michaela? What is this? Were you trying to sell her out? No? Is she over here? Where is she? Are you pissed that the Michaela's not helping? She DC'd! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, I think I understand what was happening. Cause you know, there was a part in like the mid game there where I was like, what are they even doing? Like, where even are they? And I think this Michaela was literally just doing nothing. Like, I think she was just literally doing nothing the whole time. Because even, even when I saw them healing, like, I saw two people healing each other, and then I saw the Michaela like, back here, like, walking around. Like, she was, like, back here when they were, like, up there healing. So I think she was just, like, being the worst teammate ever, and this... <laughs> this dude was like, hey, man, look, I'm cool with dying, but I just want to make sure she dies, too. So he ran to the corner and pointed him out, which is fucking hilarious. Honestly, that's a mood, dude. I'd be, li I'd be lying if I said I've never done that myself. I've a hundred percent done that myself a few times. So you know what? Oh, he had left behind too. Dude, he was like, he was like trying to let everybody die to go for the left behind play, like straight off the bat, dude. Like straight off the rip. Like they were fine. They, they, they could have totally recovered. And she was like, nah, dog, I got left behind. You guys all die. You guys just all die. I got left behind. I don't, <laughs> I don't know what to say about that, dude. I, I guess deserved. I don't know. What do you guys think? YouTube, this is a good time for me to bait interaction. What do you guys think? Do you guys think that she deserved to be sold out and killed and forced to DC? Or do you think the wait, wait, was it a Nia? Who was it? Or do you think that the Zarina was pure evil? Also, I'm kind of sad that we didn't get to see black box value, but honestly, I'm happy that we were able to do kind of well, dude. Thank God for Azra's resting place three gen, man. Otherwise, we'd be fucked. Anyway, uh, GG's, this was fun.
And <laughs> I mean, poor, poor, poor guy. Poor guy. I don't know what to say. Poor guy. All right, guys. That's gonna be it for the randomizer video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, if you guys did, feel free to leave the video a like. It's the easiest way to support me for free. It helps me out with the YouTube algorithm and gets more people into my videos, which is probably the best way to support if you ever want to do it at all. You know, or don't. It's cool. Also, subscribe if you want, or don't. It's cool. Uh, I'm going to be trying to upload almost daily. I'm not quite at the level where I'm going to be uploading daily, but I'm going to try to be uploading almost daily. So hopefully you guys are enjoying how much content has been being, has been being put out. And also feel free to stop by my live stream. I'm live on Twitch six nights a week over at twitch.tv slash otofu. So stop by there as well if you'd like. And thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed yourself and enjoyed the video. And until next time, I will see you guys. I'm out of here. See ya. Take care. See ya. Uh, see you later. See ya.